Robert E. Lee was a devout Christian. Yes, I, I knew that. Yes, I, I know that. like George Washington did. He set the example when he abolished slavery and not burning. Yeah. <laughs> there you go. all packed in here like prisoners. Prisoners? Uh, there's not enough room in here to cuss a cat without getting fur in your mouth. In your mouth. Back in Dixie now. Oh, <laughs> Burn it. Burn the bitch. Very good, sir. Officer, for God's sake, please don't burn the house. My headquarters, gentlemen, shall be in the saddle. Let's hope he doesn't confuse his hindquarters with his headquarters. Hope destroyed! General Lee, where are you with us up? Hope destroyed! We are so thankful for his victory over that barbarian pig, Hope. At about three in the morning, Annie called. At seven in the morning, she breathed her last breath. Come home. Know that I shall never see her again on earth and forever make it. Oh yes, ma'am. I love a beautiful garden. Your silence tells me all. And you probably think I give a damn. Jeb, you're the, you're the kind of commander that can lead these wild Virginia horsemen. I think they'll worship you, and I have an assignment just for you. Just fine, sir. But, General Anderson, you drive on like a runaway freight train, as far as you can take me. Yes, sir. We're going to win this war. I promise you that. Thank you, General Lee. Really free? Yes, indeed. Free? Gentlemen, this is a piece of paper with which if I cannot whip old Bobby Lee, I will be willing to go home. Ah! I believe it to be A.P. Hill from Harbors Ferry. Come down and give him hell! Give him hell, boys! What the hell is happening? Why are we falling back? Good God. Why are we falling back? Damn it.
guess who's in charge here? Do I make myself clear? Do I make myself clear? A favorable condition of the earth and sky. Helpful way. Mr. President, God have mercy on General Lee, for I will have none. You know, General Hooker, I'm reminded of the hen. The hen is the wisest of all animal creations in the barnyard because she never cackles until the egg is laid. General Hooker's crossing the Rappahannock with his 92,000 right now, sir. This ain't no Chinese game. That's my state. General, with 15,000, we face 50,000 Federals. If General Hooker orders but one exploratory charge, he will find our lines to be hollow. What of Jackson? That we do not know. Hold your fire! Hold your fire! Better take you down. Hold them. Hold them. Oh my god. Oh, no. General oh, Jackson! No. Sir, please inform the General and the President that I respectfully decline the honor. Respectfully, General, it's not a request. It is a direct order. I have been a soldier all my life, and I cannot see that any 14,000 men will break that line today. Enemy is there, General, and I am going to strike it. Stop it! Stop me! Don't die on me! Oh God! God, please! Full of pity, love, and power. I will. Day for you. Yes, it has. A sad, sad day. Too bad, too bad. Oh, too bad. My God, has the army been dissolved? Sir, Knox and Cannonade will take that horde of rebels out along with that bridge real quick, like, sir. Yeah. Let him be. I have the heart. We'll catch him soon enough. Let him be. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Too many brave young men to think about laying down our arms. They fight with spirit that the enemy does not possess. Don't grant that I would listen to terms. He would take that as a sign of weakness and demand unconditional surrender and I would rather die a thousand deaths.